Let's get this party started with a Yazoo Pilsner. Who's Pat, who's Parker Daddy O Hall? Google that. Nashville beer. Right here. Bright can, fun. I like that. I like the color. Yeah. You don't like red. I hate red. But that, this is this okay? Is, this is more of like a red orange, I think. That looks fire engine red to me, but. Yeah, you're probably right. You're both right. Maybe I like uh, the matte. Yeah, it is matte. That, that, that's cool. All right, Yazoo Pilsner. There we go. We got to find out who that guy is. Fruity. Hoppy. Hoppy and fruity. What? I don't understand. Aren't Pilsners just supposed to be like, I don't, I know nothing. I don't know what they're supposed to be, but it's hoppy, hoppy. and fruity. I don't like hoppy. Actually, I no. hate hoppy. Nope. It's not, it's good. It's good. I don't think so. I wouldn't drink it. I'm not, I'm not going to drink it. <laughs> that one's gone. Uh, to the brewer at Yazoo, we apologize. Jay woke up on the wrong side of the bed. He doesn't love, mean it. I love their Gerst. Okay, well, there's that. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll put mine down. Uh, all right, we're sitting here on these retro bikes. Where are these? How old are these things? I, I would say them. these have to be sometimes 70s uh, when kids were cruising around on these. Pretty cool, really cool. Do you remember uh, your favorite bike? I do remember my favorite bike. Got it for Christmas. It was a Huffy. It was maroon. It was a mountain mm. bike. Okay. I mean, it had like 12 gears, and I thought that was the coolest thing ever. That is cool. I know. Shift what? gears, because like where I lived, I was kind of a little hilly and stuff. So, you know, those one speeders, you're you're struggling. Yeah, you're so off you, your seat. You're, yeah, yeah. You click yeah. it, you click it down though. I mean, it was. I rode that thing everywhere. A lot of miles. A lot of miles logged on that bad boy. Did she have a name? No, didn't name it. Put some stickers on it, I think, but no, didn't name it. No, didn't really. Didn't have. I don't name cars. I don't name things like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotcha. I had a Huffy also. Oh yeah. Uh, and it had all these plastic pieces on it that made it look like a motorcycle. I, I'm sure you can find them on eBay or something. Well, so I got mine for Christmas. How old were you? Oh, 14. 10. Wait, you had a bike that looked like a motorcycle? Yeah, it had plastic pieces that made it look like a gas tank and this and that. Well, this bike was the coolest one in the neighborhood, right? Mm -hmm. So this kid, who I now know that now that I'm older, was jealous. So he says, man, your bike looks too new. You got to mess it up a little bit. And I'm like, really? I think it looks good like this. He's like, no, 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 man. Take my jackknife. You need to tear up the seat a little bit and make it look like this thing's been used. I said, all right, good plan. But if I do mine, you gotta, you gotta mess yours up. Sure. So I tear up my brand new bike seat. There's foam coming out. I mean, and I said, I said, here you go. Yeah. Now you do yours. He's like, no way, man, I'm <laughs> out of here. <laughs> so I go home. Oh gosh. My father sees my bike seat. Yeah. And I got punished. I bet. <laughs> and I did not get a new bike seat. What is a jackknife? A jackknife is what you used to call, I guess, a pocket, a pocket knife, knife, a folding knife. Am I showing my age? I've never heard that. Has anyone heard really? that? Jackknife's a normal thing, isn't it? I don't think so. I mean, it was. <laughs> Did you ever cut that part out? A, he gave me a pocket knife is yes. what I meant to say. <laughs> Did you ever have any bad wrecks or anything? Yes, because after that, the BMX thing oh, got going. Okay. So we Peg, build pegs jumps, oh, pegs, yeah. try and do tricks, lots of crashes. Uh, yeah, I remember one time I built a, on a hill, built a ramp. It was going down a hill. I put a ramp on the hill going down, idiots. I'm going down this thing, literally hit it, front tire lands. I went, I oh, mean, just boom. little tumble. Oh, tumbling right over top of that. Yeah, That's maybe rough. that was good training for your future. Yeah, I did. You learned, learned how to... That was my first concussion. How to, how to roll, take a hit. And 
No helmets back then. Oh, no helmets. Wasn't even a thought. You got laughed at. I, I don't even know if you could buy one. I don't, I don't, I mean, you definitely couldn't. I, maybe I probably, maybe could have, but we didn't yeah. do it. Yeah. I, I don't, I mean, this, I mean, I don't, my kids don't wear helmets when they ride their bikes. Yeah. Well, you're probably going to get a few tweets oh, yeah. about that, no, but. Sure. Someone's going to piss someone That's off. That's how We had no helmets. I'm sure they'll be fine without helmets. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, uh, little beer fact. Okay. Uh, since we're on these retro bikes, I'm sure kids were rolling around in these oh, yeah. about 1983. Yep. How many breweries do you think existed in the United States in 1983? Beer breweries. United States beer breweries, 1983. I'm gonna. I'm going to go. I think we've been dealing with some high numbers. I'm gonna go low and say. Beer breweries, 15. Close, 49. 49. Okay. Which, How many are now? Which brings us to the yeah. to the next obvious question. Yeah. How many licensed breweries in the United States today? Oh gosh, 10,000. 9,500. Oh. You're very close. Good. 95, I mean, in what, what year was the first That year? was 83, there were 49. And okay. now we're, we're just shy of 10,000. It's quite a jump. Yeah, and more coming. Uh, how many in Tennessee? Nash not, not Nashville, but all of the state of Tennessee. Beer breweries? Beer breweries. Uh, let's go with... 123. 141. Oh, man. I need to go to Vegas. Yeah. Uh, What's the next one right. we got here? Beer number two go coming in. There we go. Oh, this is Paradise Park. Beach Can. Cool can. This one's named after the uh, Maker's Trailer Park that they grew up in or something. Cool. Okay. Like I, there, there used to be Paradise Park uh, Bar downtown. Remember that one? What they called that? I think it's back. Oh, is it back? It went away and now it's back. Um, they used to have a dart, uh, vi that video game thing. You know, like Golden Tee? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was uh, for like yard darts. Really? I've never played that. It was awesome. I like this can, it's fun. It's retro. Speaking Matt, of. Here we go. What is this? American Lager, okay. Oh. This is our jam. That works for me. Yeah. Could do this all day long. Where's the rest of the case? Yeah. That's good. Just cruise around on the bike, just drinking beers. Oh, it's from New Orleans. Yeah. Did you say that? No. I read it though. Yeah. Urban good. I Urban's, like that. Urban South Brewery. Not much on the can. There's no information really, which is fine with me. That's good. I like that beer. Ooh, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna buy this. this. Is. Are you? Yeah. It's a cool beer. Yeah. An, an all malt lager with, I don't even know what that word, you can't even see that. No. Huel, Huel Melon Hops, H-U-E-L-L. -L. How do you say that? Does anybody know? I think you did it right. I don't know. Drinking, uh, this easy drinking beer is perfect for the Louisiana climate. I agree with them. You know what else it's good for? What? Cruising on these bikes. True. You can go one hand. You don't want to do your shoes first? <laughs> He's drunk. These are strong. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, but it, it, it fit together so it seamlessly. I mean, yeah, you, I mean, you were on to something, but you just forgot one segment of the show. Okay, um, I guess this brings us to the end. Yeah. And I already knew I won this mm -hmm. when I got here today because your son looked at me and said, cool shoes. No, I saw it. When I walked in, I saw him and I was like, uh, I'm taking an L today. <laughs> but I lit, when me and Cam, we, we left, we were right, we were getting ready to leave the house. I had these on, which I do like these. I like these a lot. And I was like, do I run back inside and get another pair of shoes? And then I thought, you know what? You got embarrassed in the DR. <laughs> You're walking around barefoot down some shady road. That's true. So Couldn't I was like, you know what? The big guy probably needs a win today. Okay. I appreciate that. Yeah. 
You are you are so nice like that. But I will say that these things are. I you know what? Let's just just stop talking. <laughs> just just stop. Let's just put these up. Yeah. Camo ma makes everything cooler. It does. Camo makes everything. Cooler. I mean, it's it's camo. It's Nike. I mean. Those are cool. You know, here's the deal. If if you would have had those in the DR and I would have won the bet, I would have kept those for sure. Uh, well, <laughs> not, even, not even a question. And let me tell you something about these. Sure. This is a little bit embarrassing to admit. Mm -hmm. I'm a size 12. I couldn't find these in a size 12. So I actually bought them a half size too small because I needed to have these. 11 and a half? Yeah, 11 and a half. So it's a little bit of a toe no cruncher, time. but worth had it. to have them. Worth the pain. Worth the pain. Well worth the pain. There it is. I win. You win. I mean, no yeah. one should even comment. Yeah, don't, you don't have yeah, to Yeah, don't bother. Yeah. It's, it's over. It's definitely a win. Now. And, and they're 11 and a half. Yeah. I mean. If anyone has a 12 and they're a little too big for you, <laughs> I'll we'll give swap. you these. You send me those. And now we get to cruise. And that's a wrap on this one. Uh, that is a wrap. You this forgot is... your line again. Crap. Yeah. <laughs> well, you're you're talking over me. You get enough attention. Uh, this is this... your show. I'm a guest here. <laughs> this is outside beers because I say because because <laughs> beers are better outside. This is outside beers because beers are better outside. Beers are better outside. Take sixteen. We roll! You want to go to lunch? Yeah. That was for the cameras. I know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't really want to go to lunch. 